Oh, yeah. Do it! Woo! That'll get you going. What's going on, everybody? Today we're going to be out here playing with some Timu discs. These things actually feel pretty good for coming off of, you know, Wish.com, Timu style. We're going to be out here playing UWF with the Eagle Wigs as my putter. That's right, Eagle Wigs for all the bald eagles out there. And then uh, we have the Bison mid-range 5403. And then we have the Starbat, nice little MVP gyro technology kind of going. These actually feel pretty good. The plastic is kind of nice. This bison looks like a rock, and the Eagle Wigs is pretty sure Eagle McMahon's new signature disc. So we're gonna toss them out there, see how we do on a little nine hole. We got about 200 feet. We're starting out hole eight, just right there. Let's do the uh, bison here on the backhand. Oh, missed the Mando and on a car. <laughs> Cut. Cut that. That car already had a disc on it. Yeah, we're gonna try. <laughs> you know what? Let's just do. Let's try this Eagle Wigs out on the forehand. Oh, it flipped. I knew it's not that stable. All right. Well, we got a little look for par here, guys. We got a goal. If I can't shoot under par with these guys, we're gonna have to give one away. So make sure you like, subscribe, and leave a comment down below which one you want to win, and we're going to be picking one random person. we got a pretty long look here with the Eagle Wigs. Kind of flicking it up there. Yeah, should be an easy par there. Oh, almost missed that one. A little close for comfort. Okay, we're going to try this uh, star bat out. Just got to throw it on a lot of hyzer. Wow, it still went left. Straight OB, <laughs> straight out of bounds. Fortunately, I think we went over on the left side, so we're gonna have a little look for a par. We've got a little damage report on the fake gyro. Took a little bit of a chunk out of it. Honestly, not too bad though. Held up pretty good. The bat is right here. So I'm just gonna play it from like right here. We gotta save this par. Oh, and I throw it straight to the ground. It's a good approach though. Nice little bogey. All right, we got hole 10. Double Mando, it's off to the right a little bit. You might be able to see it through the trees. I think I might throw the bison actually. I think I'm gonna throw the bison, try to get it a little turnover shot. Oh, wow. Okay, it's not as flippy as I thought. It actually kind of panned out, but had a nice glide to it. I like that a lot. It's pretty similar to a rock. Got a little look here. Maybe we can clean up that bogey. We're gonna hit it with a little Florida flip. Yeah, this hole, it's only 180 feet. So we gotta get the birdie. We gotta clean up this bogey. Gonna rely on this bison, cause that Eagle Wigs is uh, a little too beefy for me. <laughs> Ace it. Oh my gosh, that bison's so good. What in the, that might go in the bag. Nobody take that from me. You can't, don't comment down below and say you want the bison, it's mine. And I'm pretty much a tap in. Nothing is a tap in with this uh, premium plastic wig. Oh, it stayed. We cleaned up the bogey. Let's go. Shoo. All right, we're going to be throwing out there to that blue basket. It's probably about 300 feet. We're going to throw the bat. What? Oh, nice. Dude, that's nice. nice. Oh. oh, man. That was actually dope. Had a good drive. Don't mess it up. We got this birdie. Dang. I'm just trying to give one of these things away. Holy cow. Couldn't capitalize on that last birdie. That's all right. We're gonna see if we can get this one. Blue basket where it's about 240 downhill. We're gonna be going Eagle Wigs. Now go left. Okay, it's a straight Eagle Wigs now. I don't know what happened to it, but it didn't have any fade that time. <laughs> All right, we ended up with not too bad of a putt here. Probably like it's a circle. And uh, we got a little shorty basket. So. Ah, so close. I just can't get these birdies. Dang it. 
We're going to the yellow basket this time on the cupcake. It's like 220, something like that. So I'm gonna go bison again. Good old bison, see if it turns for me a little bit. Oh yeah, do it! Off the dang cupcake. Wow, these things are really good. I'm seriously thinking about putting that bison in my bag. I'm not gonna lie. Wow, woo, that'll get you going. <laughs> Two aces on the on the, the Timu disc almost, what? Thankfully I didn't hit this and go like 100 feet roll away there. Let's get this birdie, come on. Yes, looks like I'm keeping my Timu disc today, maybe. Maybe, we got some more holes left. A little damage report on the bison. Got a little chunk out of it, but it's a little roughed up. It's honestly not that bad though. First slamming onto the concrete. Pretty good, it's holding up good. We're gonna throw it on this one, it's 180 feet. Got like a left to right, kind of weird swirly wind. So we'll see what happens. Wow. Yeah, dude, I really like the bison, I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> That's actually a really good disc, just a solid disc. I'm gonna throw a giggle shot with the star bat on the forehand. I'm gonna try to like super hyzer. Skip. <laughs> wow, just a little pole tap, star bat. All right, looks like another tap in birdie. Oh, it tried to jump out. It really tried to jump out. And then that star bat ended up right here. I mean, come on. A, a couple feet higher and I think I would have aced with this star bat. Why are these so good? What? I wish I could play a tournament with these, honestly, but I don't think they're PDJ legal. Actually, I'm pretty sure they're not. <laughs> they don't say anything about being PDJ legal. What, what mold do you think these guys are? copycat after what do you think this this eagle wigs is comment and tell me what you think that this looks like beaded beaded mid-range and then this one i'm not sure at all maybe like a crave or something it's pretty flat maybe a little bit like thicker wing than a crave these are pretty pretty solid discs not gonna lie uh we'll throw all of them right here a final final hole we'll go bison first since we're gonna take that one. Oh, it flipped Oh my, it flipped and went straight. What a good kick. Should be an easy par. Maybe birdie. All right, Wiggs. Yeah, that one's definitely more stable than the, than the bison. That's parked. And the star bat here, we're gonna put this on a little bit more hyzer. Ah, too much. Wow, it flipped and went right. Let's see if we can't make this last putt. Come on. Good job, Eagle Wigs. Now, let's see. I just hate putting with premium plastic. I hate putting with premium plastic. <laughs> okay, at least we only got a par. All right, guys, got pretty lucky today. I'll get to keep my Timu discs. Pretty excited about that because I'm excited to do more videos with these. Again, I would go play a tournament with these. Like, you know, like, I mean, I'll do like a tag round or something where you know i can actually use these discs but let me know if you guys would like to see that leave a like and a comment do all the youtube stuff i appreciate you guys and uh, we'll see you next time peace